Hey everyone, it's Incision Reality here, and welcome back to Barrow Hill, Curse of the Ancient Circle. Um, this is the second time I've had to do this introduction, as unfortunately halfway, um, about 10 minutes into the footage, uh, the, my game crashed. So, um, not ideal. So I think... Um, only thing I managed to do was I looked around for a little bit more. Um, nothing in here, this room, but in here, actually, I looked at this again and I realised you can do this and tie that round. So, did that do it? Uh, Okay, so yeah, so that was literally the only thing I managed to do. In here, there's a few things to look at, such as fish. Obviously, that's not too interesting, but down here we have a load of egg cups, which I haven't found the use for at the moment. A load of oxtail soups. Um, oh yeah, and also this basket. Other than that, there's nothing else in here to grab, but... Um, Obviously, I mentioned about your vets, giant marrow. Your vets could be a um, reference to most haunted, but I doubt it. It's just, it's just a name. I don't know. Um, so, just warning about washing your hands. I read all that. I'm not going to read it again. Uh, um, so we've got the radio station. So all the radio stations were the same, except from the actual radio. This one. Freaking me out a little, which I assume was their idea. Why anybody wants to spend a night crashing about in the bushes, I don't know. Maybe Wincy will see them off. I, I can't get an outside line, but hopefully you'll be able to call in to me here at Barrow Hill on 585 2131. It's exactly 15 minutes to 8. No, that can't be right. Looks like my clock stopped. Well, this is Emma Harry. Why not give me a call and let me know the correct time? The number again is 585-2131. I've lined up some more tunes to ease you into the night. So let's get down to business. Okay. I'm, I'm just going to turn it off. Always save electricity, guys. Uh, so we got the time here, which is 528. Not sure if that's the idea at the right time. So... Um, also here, we've got our um, stove. Uh, don't know if that will be useful. Um, we have a door here, which obviously needs a padlock. Um, oh yeah, sorry, that's back out. Uh, the only other thing I noticed, or that was useful, was the blender. Um, you need something to blend, which I'm not obviously sure yet. Uh, so, oh, yeah, so I'm going to start looking in the other rooms. Um, so I just wanted to get to here, one, two, three. The lock is set to one, two, three. Uh, which room is that again? Number two. Oh, looks like we need something here. Is that a key or something? Oh. Oh, the trowel does it. Oh, wow. Oh, so we got some coins. That's actual real money as well. That's not... Obviously, it's real money, but it looks like real money. That's pretty cool. Um, nice. So, uh, that's something obviously I missed. I've gone all through all this already, haven't I? Yeah. Um, mint go. Okay. So, um, I think I've done that already.
Uh, I'll tell you what, I can't. Oh, one, two, three, wouldn't it? Just want to see just anything that I've missed. Because I'm a bit. I mean, I, I've got no idea what to use egg cups. The only thing, maybe, is in the wells to fill the water up because it might be a blessing to move the stone. Um, but I'm not sure. No, I doesn't realize there's anything in here now, anyway. Um. Uh, I'm sure, I'm still convinced that is, we need a trowel to dig something up here. Looks like something's hidden something, like maybe the artifact or what. So I'm going to go into the wow again. Alci Pet Prestridge. Prestige. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is where I read about the purple candle. Which I've done it, but. Do you use the egg cups for the water? You wouldn't put it in the basket, would you? Okay, what's that done? Uh, I've, I've tried this already. So I wonder if you need to do it like clockwise. I'm guessing. Do we need to? Right, that's them all done. No, they just go back out again. You're not going to be using an egg cup in there, are you? I'm just clicking randomly now. Um, that's pretty annoying. Nothing else we can do here. Uh, oh, I was just going back to my car. Um, let's have a look back down here. There's definitely nothing we can do here, is there? It's almost like you can go in there, but it just doesn't want us to. Maybe we need to get the motorbike up and going, or... Not quite sure. Survey map. I'm not sure where we are on this. So if that's a service station... No, I've got no idea where we are. Ooh. Hold on, there's a path down here. Yeah, here we go. Is someone we haven't been before. Thank God for that. I was beginning to get a bit... Like, what the hell do we do next? So surely there's something... Ah, oh, damn it. That's not opening. That uh, sounds like it's locked. Right. Good gate. Oh. Aha, uh -huh, here we go. Ah, awesome. Progression. I'm loving it. Stop the D. That's almost like it happened as... Something's happened as uh, they were writing that. That's uh, pretty unsettling. Oh, God, this makes a lot of noise. Uh, I'm sure this is safe. Uh, maybe not. Bloody hell. Okay. Right, is that gas? We don't want that going, surely. No, I'll leave that alone for a sec. I'm guessing, yeah. We need to open that. Oh, that's brilliant. So that'll probably let us out, maybe uh, somehow. Oh, no. Tubing, some tubing. This is, a, I'm absolutely loving this game, I tell you. I mean, it might not look like a lot for some people, but. I'm really enjoying it. Let's go back upstairs and just see what we can uncover here. 
Um, oh dear, compass spinning around on my old go sensor I used to do was not good. Got a stopwatch as well. I wonder what the stopwatch was used for. Uh, got some binoculars. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Oh, god damn it. Oh, you can actually look through the binoculars. That's pretty cool. Oh, that is creepy. Are they moving? Oh, look at that. Look at the drop of the moon behind them. That's pretty creepy. Uh, don't suppose anything happens. Right, let's read all this then. Trevor Spencer. So I'm guessing these are the guys, like the protesters, like, uh, as Stop the Dig and all that. Esteemed archaeologist, ha, I found out today that the ancient site at Barrow Hill is going to be dug up by an archaeologist called Conrad Morse. How he got permission as well, I have no idea. I've been spreading the news at college. Something has to be done. We are going to get together and stop them. September the 14th. Made our first visit to Barrow Hill. It took a while to find. It's not featured on any maps. It's no excuse. I hate destruction performed in the name of archaeology. We will search for a base camp for our next visit. There has to be a good lookout. September the 16th. Finished the leaflet design today during media studies. Miss it, Mrs. Burkett didn't notice the old prune. Mark is staying behind at college tonight and tomorrow to print off as many copies as he can. Good to know my college fees are good for something. Print away. September the 18th. We return to Barrow Hill and have set up our base camp in a barn. Halfway to Winchwood Barry is meant to be driving his van up tomorrow with some more leaflets. They will need folding. Sarah and Mark are handling them, handing them out at college and will visit St. Awful Shopping Centre to drum up interest. September the 19th. It's been raining so much but I have kept an eye on the archaeologist. Vandals. They have been moping and miserable between downpours. Perhaps it's nature's way of protecting the circle. 1.20pm. Conrad Morse has been visiting the circle and the altar stone during the storms. He's always muttering to himself. He carries... How is that spelling? His notebook, notebook all the time, scribbling away. Scribble, scribble. No doubt he's planning which part of the site to ruin next. Is that ruin? I try to get a couple of photos, but the weather makes it impossible. 2.20pm. Spotted Conrad's assistant walking down the rest road. He went to look at that overflowing well. I thought his assistant was a her. I don't know. I let him go about his business and return to the barn. Maybe he's on about him. I don't know. Um, I'm very worried about the floor. It creaks alarmingly and I feel it's unstable. Yeah, it's unstable, all right. I should be careful where I step. Cheers. 4.20pm. Did a quick rec recce? Recce? Whatever the hell that word is. Recce? Up by the stone row, as it was getting dark, Conrad went rushing up past me. I thought I'd blown it, but he ignored me and scampered down to the altar stone like a madman. He shouted something I couldn't understand. Maybe he was drunk. I could smell whiskey. September the 20th. Found a spade stuck into Barrow Hill. I've thrown it deep into the bushes. Ha! They won't find that one any time soon. Barry drove past and said he would pop back later and take over night watch. The rain has started again, rattling on this tin roof. It will end soon, I hope. It hasn't discouraged the local wildlife, as a rather perky squirrel come through the barn window and left some acorns on the sill. Ah, those are the ones we saw. 11.15am. Went to get breakfast at the service station cafe with B. He brought some more leaflets with him. Sarah is joining us later. She's bringing up some cardboard and posts to make placards. We're going to hold another protest march tomorrow up to the circle and back. She told B she would call the newspapers too. Things are hop hotting up. 12.40am. Spied on Conrad near the circle, scratching on the ground with his own hands like some kind of burrowing animal. He's clearly crazy. My friend, the squirrel, has been coming and going. He's left me more acorns. Maybe he thinks I can eat them. Funny f furry little thing. Or thing. 3 p.m. Sarah arrived, said she'd spoken to a guy called Peter up at the service station. He's Conrad's assistant for the day, for the dig. She said she was. She said he was friendly until she mentioned she was part of the protest. Bet she fancies him. 7:20 p.m. We all climbed up the hill to the circle. The woods are rather frightening in the dark, like something out of a horror movie. We observed Conrad from the edge of the mound. 
he seemed to be arguing with himself and walking from stone to stone. We snuck away after a while. He's getting creepy. September the 21st, 2am. We were all woken by the strangest of sounds. A dull rumble or scraping sound. Then the barn f floor started to shake. It didn't seem like machinery or passing traffic. Sarah was very scared. We couldn't see anything outside the windows. It all went quiet. Too quiet. We sat looking at each other for some time. Listening as hard as we could. Then suddenly someone or something slammed into the doors downstairs. By the time we'd climbed down to look there was nothing out there. Mark thinks it was someone from college playing a trick. I am not so sure. 12.20pm. Woke up very tired after last night. I don't think any of us went back to sleep properly. We have been making the placards for today's protest. Sarah's taking a break outside as the point paint fumes have made her feel dizzy. Perhaps it's a good time to stop for lunch. 2pm. We are going to walk up to the service station once the paint has dried. Barry's already waited, waiting up there in his van. Hopefully a reporter from the papers and some new recruits will turn up, especially with all those leaflets we've handed out. I'd be glad to never fold another, e another e leaflet in this lifetime. Barry thinks we should paint a sign onto the standing stones. We have to make our voice heard. We can't let the ancient site be destroyed any further by those crazy archaeologists. All is set. Tonight is the night. We will save the stones. The others don't know, but I have a strange feeling of dread. I can't place it, nor can I shake it. What could possibly go wrong? Maybe I've been watching the stones too long. Perhaps I'm delusional, but I would swear I saw the sentry stone move as dust was falling. That is his last entry, so what's happened to him as well? Okay, let's see all this stuff. Um, stop the dig, say Barrow Hill. Permission has been recently granted to destroy one of England's most important ancient monuments in the name of archaeology. Conrad Morse has given the go-ahead to rip up the ancient stone circle and burial mound on Barrow Hill, including the outer circle and stone row, in pursuit of archaeological glory, despite claims that the investigation will preserve any finds and the site as a protected monument, Morse is no longer than a site self-righteous treasure hunter. The area has never been disturbed before and should not and should be left in its natural state, not be dis dissected and put under the microscope. The excavation is already underway and your support is needed to save as much of the site from desecration as possible. The archaeologist must be stopped. Join the protest on Barrow Hill and send your letters of complaint to your local council and county heritage representative. Two St. Awful, two Sore Point. Funny names. Okay. Uh, wonder where um, the radio station is and all that. Is that it? Oh, there's a camera. Oh, good, yeah, I didn't expect that to turn on. Let's see what they got here then. Okay, cranes. I don't know what that is. Is that, is that the petrol station? I'm not sure. Oh, it could be inside of a train. Train, train. I suppose that's them arriving now. That could be where we put the car. It's a lovely view. Trees. Oh, lovely cow. That's That can't be... Everything else looks real photos, but this doesn't look real. Oh, don't know who that is. Could be Barry. Lovely chicken. More lovely views. That's the well. Huh, that looks fun. Oh, dear. Didn't expect that. Um, yeah, okay. So... No, I just gotta find out how to get away from this place. Oh, ominous music. They do like their ominous music in this game. That sounds pretty terrifying. I've gotta admit. Uh oh, just more leaflets. I love just the attention to detail. They didn't have to have that little thing. It adds nothing to the game, but they wanted it anyway. Uh
Okay. Do I need to find another bit first? Um. Okay. Sugar, I'm wondering if there's another bit we've yet to find. Hmm, I don't know. I just thought it'd be tube. Oh, okay. Right. I think I tried that. There we go, we're free. Oh, and I get to keep uh, both bits. Okay, that's handy. I'm sure I tried that. Uh, just before I leave, I don't suppose there's anything else. Up here before I leave. I uh, saw that already. No, I think that's it. Okay. Um, didn't really get much out of that, did I? Oh, come on, that so looks like there should be something in there. Oh, is. Is he going to say anything? It touched them and then they were gone. Absorbed. Disappeared. Torched to nothing. The screams. I can still hear them. See their faces as they ran towards the cafe. Just after Conrad sped away in his jeep. That wasn't like him. He must have seen it. A sentry. A scout. A hunter. Lashing out for its master. Like being chased down by a dog. As if we were the trespassers. It won't get me in here. It won't find me now. You should hide too. You can't come in here. I'm not opening this door for anyone. Take this. Use it to get into the empty room. Ooh. No one's in number one. I've not seen anyone else. Oh, brilliant. But you. Six, six, now two. go. Go and hide before you lure it in here. Oh, cheers. Thank you. That's, uh... Shit, what's going to be in here? What? We're in six. Oh my god. Bloody hell, I've got it already. Um, okay, looks like they're decorating or refurbishing this room. Uh, random paintbrush. Not too useful. There's going to be something really good in here, isn't there? Uh, spade. That would be quite useful, actually, but. Uh, come on. Give me the goods. Anything useful in here? No? Are you serious? Lovely picture, but we want more than that. I wonder where that is. Excuse me. Oh, wow, that's the most useful. Seriously. Oh, what's this? Oh, is that a GPS? Please let it be a GPS. Uh, oh, GPS. Lovely. Now, where did that bloke say? Oh god, what was his number? 913? 931, sorry. Oh, first time. I um, think it was this note. Uh, to, the only place the G GPS device appears to work. God, how are we going to find that? Look at it, it's going crazy. I uh, better write that down. Or put it in a code on my phone. 
I don't want to install an update now. Uh, oh, funnily enough, I've already, uh, I've already got it. Um, so how am I going to find this? Hey, oh, stopped. Did you say the only place the GPS works? So I've, what, I've got to dig behind me, or? Or is it in there somehow? Oh! Here we go, we've got one half. That's awesome. Okay, that's good. So we've got one and a half, but really that doesn't give us too much progression. Does he say anything else? <laughs> knock, knock, knock. Who's there? Who cares? No. What was meant to be honoured, remembered, has fallen into ignorance. Everything's... Oh, hold on. Oh yeah, everything's 5-2, innit? I just want to know as well. Um, what's this? Uh, okay. Oh god, do I need some like tracing paper or something, perhaps? Um put a coin in there, no. I don't know. I'm still unaware what to do with these. I'll just come in here just for a little bit of hope. I remember him saying the other one is by the the cameras are looking at. So that's obviously on the stones. Let's see, where on earth is this? I can't quite tell. I wonder if you actually appear, if you get it to that location, it will appear. You will appear on there. Again, this I'm not sure. That's obviously more images of the stone. Is that a red dot? Oh, is this where I am? Oh, cool. That's handy. So, where have we been here yet? That looks quite a big area. Let's see if we can find where that is. It's going to be very frustrating. I'm going to have to keep switching back and forth. Hold on, is this going all the way back? There we go. I might go in the right direction. I should be checking, shouldn't I? Okay, I'm past. What the hell? Uh. Why can't I progress? Looks like there's like a style, but for some reason we can't get over it. Alright, pack it in, bird. Um. I wonder if you do need to do something with a motorbike. So I'm thinking we need tracing paper. God knows where we're going to find that. And we need a way to... I'd use his... Um, close his tracing paper. Don't suppose it would work. Uh... And do we need to use the motorbike? Uh, blind fiddler.
Um, just see if there's any other paths. I don't think there are because um, otherwise uh, it'd be shown up. I think that was that's no, it's that down there. Oh, it's more dig site things. Stop the dig. Oh. Okay. I love, again, love this level of detail. Like, that's so unnecessary to have a... As is used for something later on. I'm clicking on all my little bits here. But I don't think so. This is this, uh, didn't mean to get close to that. Don't want it killing me again, do we? Of course. Uh, no. no, I want to go in here. Just in case there's anything we're missing. Damn it. I always find seem to find my way back here. Okay. Don't think there's anything here. Oh something here, something here. Again, it's like what is the point of this? That says intentional, but I think it's just to throw you off, isn't it? It's very clever. Oh, God. So we've got to find some scrap paper. So is there anything going to be over here? Whenever you're stuck, oh, just find time to have a little sit and think. Where might there be scrap paper? Maybe a kid left some down. No. They won't know where I am. Shut up. The hell? Just scoop some up. That is really random. Get a cup. Oh, here we go. Lovely, we've got a cup full of. What the hell is going on? The ancient land has awoken. Balance must be restored. Balance must be restored. Oh, I've actually got it in my old thing. Um, okay, that was random. Again, I'm just looking for tracing paper though. That would be ideal. Can I use the letter? No. Uh, so I'm probably going to be doing a load of jump cuts now until I find something. Super rotor template for idiot people with no DTP skills. Oh, dirty dishes. Again, why do we need to see this? Oh, my baskets just appeared. So. Oh, I better just check. Is that alright? No, it's not good. Uh, okay. 
Well, we've got it anyway. So do I have to collect some stuff? So I might have missed a load of things here. Oh, we've got another mushroom for our basket. Oh, I've been going for quite a while now, guys, trying to find what to do next. But I think I might have found a glory hole. So ain't that nice. There's nothing I can use on it, and there's something I definitely don't want to use on it, but that is literally the only thing I've found in a long time. And it's quite possibly disgusting. So, there you go. Um, don't know how l much longer I can go on. I mean, that's the only thing this can be, is, isn't it? Definitely not a spy hole. Uh, I don't know. Um, weirdly enough, you can't really see it this side. So, I've been looking for... Um, sit on the toilet whilst I just guys I've been looking for tracing paper a way to get to the next place I've gone in through all the rooms I've literally gone through everywhere I reckon and I've not found a single one more clue as to what to do it's got to be something really obvious I'm gonna go in the ladies I reckon it must be somewhere pretty obvious, or at least somewhere near the service station, because I think the list of the items are over. We found like an item really far away, but just not. Just not the bloody tracing paper. I did not go to the toilet then, I don't know why it flushed. It almost looks like there's a code, like up there, like a numbered code, but I don't know. I don't know what it is. This is out of order. No spy holes in there. I don't know if I'm just going delirious, but I thought I saw it go to a zoom symbol then, but obviously not. I'm starting to get pretty tired. Oh wow, this box looks like it should hold, hold something I need, but it doesn't. Oh, there's even a knife there. What's this for then? Oh, right, okay. Thing is, I don't know what I'm doing here, mind. Damn it, I really hope there was some progression then, but... Uh, 
until I get every ingredient or until I know what ingredient I need. This paper must be so bloody obvious where it is. Um said this. If you move it out of the way. There's a first time we're interacting with this, but again, there's just nothing there, is there? Every time you think you're going to make progression, you don't. Annoyingly, that's not handy, is it? There's got to be something to this, though, surely. It's not just a fancy noise going off. I'm just so desperate, I'm just clicking anything. Hmm, I don't know what to do with that. Um, right, okay guys, I've gone around for a while now. I was hoping to leave on like a high point, like I'd found something new, but... I haven't been able to. Um, it's getting like... Coming up to probably about an hour or two now, I don't know. Um... Uh, really annoying but uh there we go I've just said I've tried as much as I can. I'm gonna have to I'm very persistent of checking online walkthroughs. Um really don't wanna do that. Um so I'm gonna have to just struggle on my own for a bit. Um, next video, obviously, hopefully, I'll try to. I'll try and get some. Um, try and get some more progression. I mean, I don't think we're doing too bad. We've got quite a bit this episode. But, uh. Yeah, just unfortunately, not as much as I'd like. Because I still think. There's quite a lot we need to do. Um, basically, we're looking for some paper, which must be so bloody obvious, and I just can't seem to see it. Um, and we are looking for a way to get over where I just was, which is very annoying. Almost looks like you can get through there, but I don't think you can. Um, so, anyway, I said finishing on a little bit of a low point, but... Never mind. Um, regardless, thank you so, so much for watching. Take care, take it easy, and I shall see you 
in the next one. Is that blood on those ferns? Random red light from somewhere. What was it? I don't know. Um, yeah, so I'll see you in the next one. Thank you and goodbye.